So we're here at the Bond in Motion exhibition in central London where they've got cars and vehicles from all of the Bond films and I'm here with Jonathan Sands who's the CEO of, of the London Film Museum and uh, this exhibition here. Thanks for speaking this, to us today Jonathan. Thank you for coming. Thank you very much. So. Uh, of course, this car collection, or some of the cars, used to be down at the Motor Museum in Bewley, down in Hampshire. Yes. What made you move them back up, Earl, up here to London? Well, it was, uh, I think, uh, the desire to have um, a, a principal exhibition like this in, in central London has, has been on the cars for a long time. It's just finding the right sort of space and the right partners to work with. Um, of course, we were extremely proud when E.ON uh, agreed to, to, to allow us to, to uh, mount uh, Bond in Motion at the London Film Museum. And of course, you know, now it's up, all up and running and a year down the line, we're hugely proud that we've, we've been able to work with them on, on the new film. And a visitor come in here, what can they expect when they, when they arrive? Okay, well now we're, we're, we're uh, displaying all 24 films, um, going back to the very first car chase in, in Dr. No. Of course, it's the largest official collection of original James Bond vehicles. And every film is represented, uh, whether it's in, with, with a full-size vehicle, with a model, a prop, costume or, or artwork and of course it's, it's been curated with, with lots of layers so uh, visitors can expect to see more than just vehicles. Uh, are you a Bond fan yourself? Is that what drove you to do this? Yeah I mean you know I've grown up with Bond and Roger Moore was, was uh, he was practically a family member you know you know he's in the house so many times you know it, I, I think it, it, you know it's one of those things that's that's part of the part of the psyche when you're growing up and uh, you know huge Bond fan you know. So did you play with the Bond cars as a, as a kid, you know, the toy models? Yeah, and I think the Lotus, you know, we all lost the missiles that came, up the, came off the back of that, uh, came off the back of that, that uh, toy. Um, but uh, we have uh, some of those iconic uh, merchandise pieces on display as well. Fantastic. And maybe you've still got the guy out of the ejector seat underneath your fridge. We, well, no, we have actually found him and he's here on display. He's, uh, yeah, live and direct, he's here. And of course here we are literally surrounded by the, the cars and vehicles from Spectre as an extension yeah. to the exhibition and that opens tomorrow I believe? Uh, the, the Cars of Spectre opens tomorrow and we, like I said before, we're very fortunate to have worked uh, alongside the production to, to, to select some of the pieces, worked with Meg Simmons from the archive to, to select some of the pieces that are, that are here on display. And again, it's not just vehicles, it's also supported with costumes and artwork and, and some of the artifacts from the film. Have you had opportunities to drive any of them yourself? Well, we had to drive them in, you know, so uh, enough said. <laughs> Sounds like a great excuse. And uh, of all the cars and vehicles you've got here, uh, I forget the number, it's over 100, isn't it? What's your favourite of all of the vehicles? Well, we're now actually over 150 artefacts. Um, and I think, you know, th those iconic uh, items like Little Nelly and, and the Lotus will, will always be right up there because, you know, they, they, they were the the cars that we grew up with them I and the db5 is so iconic but i do love the db10 you know and it's, it's it's just really just continued on that that story and to have it here in the flesh you know is just amazing or in the metal <laughs> absolutely it's all about bond it's all about bond jonathan thank you ever so much Thanks thank so you much. thank you for coming ladies and gentlemen you're watching hey you guys hey you guys huh hey you guys, is yeah. that from the goonies it is indeed, yeah. nice Hey!